this is how far I've got on my latest engine the Whitmore and Binion and I'm working on this part now that goes here and specifically this little sliding part it's very three dimensional and I'm just thinking about how you make that slope and the rounded how it transitions one to the other this is a practice piece and I'm doing the uh, real thing in mild steel and um, I thought can I make some sort of stop mechanism on the rotary table that will make that predictable so let's have a look so the first job is to get the rotary table centered and I usually start by having a piece of 12 millimeter bar there and this fixture and I'll just move the table around till they're parallel and you can sort of double check with a ring there so we're in place there that comes out and then this is the fixture I'm going to put in there and I need to get that aligned so I've got this plate clamped on the back and I've got something there to line that up with get that square and then I'm going to tap that down hope that holds and then go back to my starting point zero <coughs> and take this off I've made this temporary very temporary trial that can clamp there and I can put a, a pin in those different holes and I can clamp that down there and that goes in there and by finding which hole will be suitable to stop at I'm hoping that that will keep a controlled position something like that and you can adjust a fine adjustment there or you could put a ring on there these holes are every 10 degrees anyway I've got to work that out now where that's going on one side and setting up the other side I just need to make a little adjustment here so that when that stops we're right on the 15 degree slope I want and it just comes to the naught there and Let's try that.
Look at that. So maybe I could do a bit more here. Looks alright so far. Just got this last little bit to do there. 